Hey guys, Lord Ashwa here, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon White. In the last episode, we climbed Dragon Spiral Tower and found out that Team Plasma have the control of the legendary Pokemon Reshiram. Here, we were told to go to Relic Castle, where we are right now, and see if we can find the Dark Stone so we can have the power of Zekrom. So, let's continue on with Relic Castle. Uh, I'm gonna throw on a repel, let's see if I. Oh. <laughs> Not a problem. We've got a Team Plasma member right here because it's just the beginning of the video. I'm gonna battle this guy on screen. So, you. To please my Pokemon, lose. Uh, no? Alright, alright. Scrun has Scraggy. Uh, which is quite bad because Scruggy is also part dark type, so um, if he has any dark type moves, we might be in for a world. Of so let's use just use Flame Burst right here. Very, very good. Next up, Watch Hawk. Not a problem for us. Another flame burst. Excellent. Not a problem. Okay, so we took care of that run. Just gonna slowly walk over. Sand here. Um, I'm gonna try go up those stairs. See what there is. Absolutely nothing. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> um, moving along, um, we've got another grunt here, I'm just going to battle this grunt off the screen, see you guys in just a moment. Alright, with that member battled and defeated, we can move on just a touch. We want to come over here, I want to see what this is. We have the TM30 for Shadow Ball, I'm going to be teaching that to uh, Sol straight away, yes please. Um, that's obviously better move. So we need to go find them. TM30 for Shadow Ball, we just went past it. Shadow Ball to a Pokemon, yes we shall. Okay, so learn Shadow Ball for in place of Hex, because Shadow Ball, the better move. Much better move. It's Hex and we learn Shadow Ball, awesome. So with that, we can now just sink into this hole. Uh, moving around. Oh, yeah, I need another repel. Oh, new Pokemon! Uh, Cofagrigus um, is the evolution of Yamask. I believe you can get Yamask in here, I'm not too sure. Um, we can also get other Pokemon in here as well. Uh, we'll I'll keep a repel off for now and see if you can come across any new Pokemon. Um, Cofagrigus is just your standard ghost type, uh, so nothing of great interest. I'm just going to go down here for now, see if I can find the TM4 Earthquake. If it's down here, of course. Um, we've got Item Ball here, we found a Sunstone. So there's that. Um, so if you've got any Pokemon evolved by Sunstone, there you go. Uh, you can get Krokorok in here. Uh, I don't know if there's any other Pokemon other than Krokorok or Cofagrigus. I'm not entirely sure. So, um, yeah. So far, so good with Pokemon you can find in here. They're all level 35, so they're good for experience too. We'll come run into it. Another Krokorok. Would you go away, please? I've run one more Crocker Rock, the repel's going on. So we just want to hop over there. Um, yeah, another Crocker Rock. So I think it's just Cock Crocker Rock and Coffee Creek, you can get in here. So, um, yeah, I'll try and find out where you can get your mask. I think you can get up in this little last student tower, I'm not too sure. So I'm just going to throw on the repel, like I said. 
Pal, pal, where are you? Um, that's medicine, that's why. We need to stock up some repels. Damn, we do. Um, nothing of great interest there. Let's go up this staircase. Hop over. Oh, back to the two memos before. Yeah, if you run, you will be dragged in regardless. So I recommend when you get to those points, walk. Use walk. Do not run. I'm just gonna skip ahead from this uh, member here because obviously we've got a lot of plasma fights in here. So I do apologize. I'll be right back. Doggy, I'm just gonna walk forward and see what the iron ball is. This iron ball right here is a max revive, an excellent item. Just gonna walk over here, see what there is. We've got team plus member there, but we'll take this one, see if this leads anywhere else. Uh, no, that leads to that lump of mount there. So, um, pointless. Very, very pointless. Anyway, moving on. Do whatever you want, you're still gonna be trapped. Let's drop us there, and um, we're gonna walk around. Um, we'll walk this way instead so we can see where we're going. Uh, we're gonna get into another fight right about here, so, um, yep, another jump ahead. So, with that, I'm just gonna walk around, see where that iron ball is. Peep you up. Excellent. Um, I'll use that in a few instances on something uh, very soon. Just jump through this hole here. You've got to get into a double battle right here. So there's that. Um, or not. I thought we would have got into a double battle. Obviously not. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'll just battle these two on screen because there's not much to do, really. Um, so got level 46. I'm going to be focusing on with Soul for the time being until we get to the next gym. Uh, I'm going to get everyone to level 50 before, well, after, tr before and after the next gym, except for one. So I'm going to be using him for the gym. I'm just going to use a flame burst here, uh, or not? Um, even though that isn't going to work, and I'm going to take out Scruggy anyway. Fair enough. Watch hog. No, nope. we're gonna stick with soul. Um use flame burst there. I need to probably use one of my uh, ethers in just a moment. There's that. If you that grunt. Yeah, let's go into the next grunt. We'll tolerate people who have different ideals. Okay, fair enough. Plasma Grunt. Got rubbish. See, you know about rubbish. It's basically the grammar of the game. Um, I'm going to show you how weak Incinerate actually is. Um, flame Burst when I took out rubbish. Incinerate doesn't. This is why. Um, I can't wait to get the TM for Flamethrower. I don't know why all the good TMs are so late in the game. Um, so right again. There you go. What's that? Uh, next up, Lipard. Um, we, all, we all know about Lipard, so I'm um, just going to use Flame Burst. Take out Lampard. Uh, Lampard. Lampard's a footballer, uh, or soccer player. Lipard, player. Uh, for you, most of you who want to know, I am actually a Newcastle United fan. I know we are doing terrible, but this is a let's play of Pokemon, not soccer. So, yeah. <laughs> Off track a bit. Just gonna fall down here. Woo, I finally caught up. You two, come here, come to my side. Looks like everyone is here. Seems you are working hard to resurrect Zekrom, the other dragon-type Pokemon, aren't you? 
It appears the dark stone you seek is not here. Well then, congratulations, Arnold and Richie. You were chosen by our king. Truly the desire to keep the world as, as it is, where Pokemon live alongside people. You must bring the other dragon type Pokemon spoken of the legend and battle with our king. Otherwise, Team Plasma will steal every Pokemon from every person in the world and release them all. Release them, you say? Do the Pokemon who live with their trainers actually want that? Is the liberation you talk about really just stealing Pokemon from people? What's this? Champion Elder, even though Elders took the Pokemon that you had been your partner for many years, and you haven't had a serious battle in all that time. Even you, who ordered the Elite Four to protect the Pokemon League and left to wander the Unova region alone. Even a champion like you now wants to protect a world where Pokemon and people live together? Team Plasma's King will show the people of the Unova that he is stronger than a champion who keeps Pokemon bound. Just like the hero who founded Unova, he will be accompanied by the legendary Pokemon. He will give this order. Trainers, release your Pokemon. For this, we've prepared a su subtle castle for the legendary restaurant and our king. I won't lose. I'll fight for all trainers who love their Pokemon and for all Pokemon who believe in their trainers. Our king has no interest in you. He has already determined that victory against you is assured. So you stay behind just to tell me that? Just to make a fool of me? Of course not. I'm doing this out of kindness. Yes, kindness. And making sure the champion doesn't get hurt for no reason. Granted, the moment we sometimes lose all hope, I really do love to watch that moment. Well then, farewell. Alder, what are you going to do now? Hmm. Seems my only choice is to return to the Pokemon League and battle in. But it bothers me to do exactly what Gastus wants. More importantly, we should. What should we do about the Darkstone? Alder, why don't we go outside for now? Yes, that is a good idea. It's hard to breathe in here. It's hard to put into words, but I'll never forgive them for this. What could that guy called N possibly want? Could he be trying to prove he is right by winning the battle of the two dragons? Richie! Richie! Hello, Richie! Oh, you picked up! Hey, Richie! Come to the museum in Nakreen City immediately, right away! Got it? I mean, right now! Hear yeah, Professor Juniper's voice come clear over here. Seems like something big is happening. I wonder what is waiting at the museum in Nakreen City. Go on ahead. I'll look around here once more. I don't want to believe what the, that guest is says. You should head for the Nakreen City Museum. Well, we could do that, but for instance, I'm gonna go back inside. Reason being, I want to find TM Earthquake. So with that, I'll skip ahead until I find that TM. So back inside, I got to the very bottom floor, and obviously I haven't found TM Earthquake just yet. This is a room where he would have had like guest this and all everything. So obviously there is nothing here. I guess that I was totally wrong about TM Earthquake being here in Relic Castle. Um, uh, which is quite disappointing for me actually because I really wanted that TM. So with that I'm gonna move on. I think he learns Earthquake a a naturally anyway. So with that I will hold off for the time being. So I'm just gonna use my Pokemon to do as I told and fly to Nakreen City. Stelia. Yep, Nakreen City. There we go. So here in Nakreen City, gotta go to the museum, which is also the gym. There we are. 
Aldo told me what's going on. Richie, you got caught up in something serious, it seems. Is this it? Oh, isn't that the stone found in the desert resort? Yes, that's right. But is this really a dragon-type Pokémon? Surely, when I investigated Dragon Spiral Tower, I found elements that would date it to the same era as this dark stone. I looked into that. Impressive as always. But you know, we're lucky. Because what if Team Plasma like noticed that the old stone that time? It's a good point. It's clear to me that they were trying to steal this dr the Dragon Skull so they could revive the legendary Dragon type Pokemon. If you would, Richie, take this. Wait a moment, Richie. If you take this Dark Stone, that means you'll be the one to battle N if anything happens to me. Are you really okay with that? We've we've uh, faced uh, more danger back in Hoenn, so yeah, I'm fine with that. I understand. You are determined to take on this duty. Then here it is. Prepare yourself. Be strong. I see. If things don't go as planned, you'll use this Dark Stone. Protect the ideal future for us and Pokemon. Richie, we're counting on you. Please take care of yourself. Well, we received the Dark Stone. So how do we wake the Dragon type Pokemon from the stone then? That's it. We've got them, don't we? Aha, we've got those two. Go to Oplusid City. The gym leader of that city uses dragon type Pokemon. The gym leader could know something. I'll go ahead and wait for you there. Until then. That's right. Oplusid City. Irises might sell something. Hey Richie, never forget that you always have Pokemon right by your side. Going to head back to the lab to do some research. I'll see if I can undercover what kinds of beings these legendary dragon type Pokemon are and if there is any way to awaken them. Don't worry, if we have something for you, I'll come running to find you. Ooh, sounds real serious. Mm, that's about all I got out of it. Richie, do you know where Oplucid City is? When you leave Icarus City and like cross the Tubeline Bridge, it's on the other side. I'm not that great with directions, so if you need more, check your town map. So, um, with that, let's fly back to Icarus City and, well, head towards the Plucid City. There we go. So we need to head to Route 8. It's not a problem for us. So, I believe if we go down there, we could go to Route A. Uh, obviously, in here, I want to heal the team very, very quickly. I actually want to stock up on repels as well. Trust me, you're going to be needing them very soon, because we're also going to be coming up to a lot, a lot of adventuring. Where wild Pokemon are quite strong, and we don't actually need the levels, because we're kind of high in levels ourselves. See us again. Okay, so with that, um, I'm going to talk to you. There, scroll down a bit. One, oh, super repels. It's uh, cost effective plus what's 50 steps? Or well, by 31 of them, so we now have 33. Yep. Done. So we want to come down here and go along this way, I guess. Um, obviously, this lake type thing would have the instance of, um, you know, ice and stuff. Uh, we've got this hat here that I didn't seem to find earlier. I remember Team Rocket let go, but Team Rocket was bye-bye, so I went my reason home. I knew Team Rocket. I did, so I pledged. But now I'm married, I am. 
for Team Rocket, there is no time by me. But happy families, big hooray. Oh, that's cool. I have a lot of souvenirs. Let me get you one. Receive a rage candy bar. Um, okay. Um, not bad. What do you have to say for yourself? It's a cool job in a faraway region. Yes, Kanto and Johto. So there's that. I didn't know about that hut till now. Awesome. Uh, moving onwards, we want to try and find our way into Route 8. Um, I don't know if it's down here at all or not. So, um, actually, what do you have to say? Route 8, awesome! We're now in Route 8. A lot of trainers here, ice physics. We have to try and move around with the ice physics. So is that as well. Um, if this was water, this would be so much easier. So, um, yeah. Got this trainer here. Well, the nature changes her look according to the seasons. I'm just going to battle her. I'll see you guys in just a moment. So after that battle, we want to try and come this way. I believe surfing it will come into an advantage for us. So just hop on races back here. Surf to the other side, and move along, and get brushed along. Thank you, weather, for that. Yep, it's going to be a douchebag, I think. Yep, as I thought, oh, this route is going to be the vein of my existence with the winter. So, thanks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We already know about the select button issue. Here, and up there, down, long, down, and along. You can now go over Tubeline Bridge and stop by Bianca. So, I've been traveling lately. I've been thinking about the things. Things like what I could do with my life and what I want to do, but I'm thinking how cool it would be to be a model like Elsa, and then how cool it would be to research Pokemon like Professor Juniper. If that's what I want to do, I'm going to have to know a lot about Pokemon, so please, would you battle with me? Uh, okay, like we had a choice. So, challenged by Bianca. Um, she's going to be staying on Stoutland. Okay, um, I'll go with it. So, Stoutland, as you can see, is the last uh, evolution of Lillipop. Got Intimidate. Um, I'll probably be using these in where one and white two. So there you go. There is um, future foreshadowing there. Just going to use Flame Burst on the Startland here. Using this work up. No problem. Um, she's using the Flame Burst. Uh, I know what fight that moves are being lowered by that. The hail. Soul is now level 47. Awesome. Uh, you want to be level 50 before after the next gym. Trust me. Uh, yeah, of course, we're going to be getting into a lot. Uh, M Ball is next. Uh, fan stage of. Um, Tepig. No Razor. Just use the surf. Surf ya. Should take care of Emborn, no problem. Did it does. Next up, um should keep using Simmer Sage. Um Back to Soul, I guess. Swarms have used Leaf Stone on Pan Sage. Just gonna use Flame Burst right here. Excellent. And last but not least should be Mushana, I believe. Yeah. 
We're going to stick with Solve. We have the advantage here, so we're just going to use Shadow Ball. It was loaded to... Way great. Um, I did... I used... Impre... Game! Use Shadow Ball. Thank you. So, done. So, can we move on, Bianca? Yep, yeah, Richie, you're amazing. I'm really, really, really impressed. Yeah, I didn't see the rest of that text because I skipped it. So we got a full restore there for beating her. And she's a bit down. Castelia City, my precious Pokemon stolen by Team Plasma. So I really, really understand. If Team Plasma forces everyone to liberate their Pokemon, there will be nothing but sad people. Richie, stop Team Plasma. Don't allow Pokemon to be stolen from trainers who love them. I think that's the truth or ideal that you've been pursuing, Richie. Oh dear. Here I've come all this way and I'm afraid I'm bothering you. When you're going through so much, all I want to do is to help you relax, Richie. Knowing you, you'll be fine. Definitely. You'll be totally fine. Guarantee it. Anyway, you know what I mean. So, yeah, so, bye bye. Uh, bye bye. So now we're on Tubeland Bridge. Awesome. So, yeah, this is Tubeland Bridge. Just walk as far as you can possibly can. I think, if memory serves, we should be stopped by the the, the Shadow Triad very, very soon. Um, get on my way, you stupid NPC. Uh, there is the Shadow Triad there, I believe. Oh, is that Gestus? I believe that's Gestus, actually. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, you stop us when we're almost near him. Come. Gestus, we brought the one you wanted. Excellent. It seems you have obtained the Dark Stone. I congratulate you and a job well done. It is my Lord N's thought that the two holders of the legendary Pokemon should put be their beliefs on the line and strive to find which is the true hero. This is not necessary, however. From his infancy, I provided him with the education required to become the hero of legend. Indeed, he has been so acknowledged by the legendary Pokemon. Such purity of his purpose is his. The liberation of Pokemon, of which I, of which Team Plasma speaks of, is the separation of Pokemon from foolish people. That's the truth. All trainers will become helpless to resist us. We alone will be able to use Pokemon. The preparations are complete, where well, my perfect plan is set in motion. First, the full few gullible Poke Pokemon trainers who are unreliable to resist Team Plasma will release their Pokemon. Then, that number will be hundred, then a thousand. In no time, even the gym leaders and the champion will become unable to fight us. Having a Pokemon will be considered a bad thing. Even people like that sad little Bianca, whose Pokemon was stolen in Castelia, will be unable to face public opinion and re release their Pokemon. That's the kind of world we'll make. You may have the stone, but there's no chance whatsoever that the legendary Pokemon will accept you as the hero. So if you're not willing to hand over your precious Pokemon, I suggest you search for some courage, because you're going to need it. Enough. He goes. What a jerk. Alright, um, so yeah, there's that. We've made over to Cripple Line Bridge. Now we're on to Route 9. Uh, Route 9 is something special. We'll go over Route 9 in just a moment here. The pitcher throws his first pitch. Here's the windup. Off him, we received TM56 Fling. When I just threw was Fling. We throw an item to do damage to the target. The damage changes depending on what you throw. 
Yeah, basically, if you have a very heavy item, you do quite a bit of damage with Fling. Anyway. So, anyway, we have done quite a lot in this episode. This is a very extra long episode for you guys. Yeah, I've spoiled you with this one. Um, we made it all the way here to Route 9, all the way to Opposite City, where we can get our 8th and final badge. We see what all were happening at Relic Castle, and we have made a lot of knowledge into what Team Plasma are doing. So with that, next time on Pokemon White, we'll be continuing on here, Route 9, seeing what there is to do, because there is something very special here on Route 9. Also, we'll make our way to Opposite City and see what there is to do there. See you guys then.